sharing cases and inviting guest users in clearance. To let internal and external members of your organization view, modify, and manage cases, you can share cases with them and define their access rights on a case-by-case -case basis. To share a case, you must first have the user account created for the person you wish to share the case with. The first step is to open an existing case or create a new one. Once you're in the Case Information page, look for the Users section. Click on the plus icon above the user list and choose Add Users. This will bring up a window showing all users, user groups, and services. Put a check mark next to the ones you wish to share the case with and click on the Add button on the bottom of the list. By default, the users you add will be given the Read Permission level. If the users you are sharing the case with need to make any changes to the case or share it with anyone else, you can change their permission level to edit or manage from the drop-down list next to their username. Once a user is added to a case's user list, they will be sent an email notifying them that they have been added to the case and inviting them to view the case details. If you want to share a specific case with someone who does not already have a clearance account, but you do not want this person to be able to search or view other cases, you can invite them as a guest. To invite a guest to view a case, First open an existing case or create a new one. If you're logged in as a regular user, click on the plus icon above the case's user list and choose to add users. From the Add Existing Users window, type in the full email address of the guest in the search field and hit enter or click on the magnifying glass icon to search. Since this person is not in the system, it will return a no results message in the user list with a link to invite the user as a guest below that. Click on the link to go to the next step. If you're a guest and wish to invite someone else to view a case, the process is very similar. Click on the plus icon in the user list and choose Invite Guest User. Using either method, you'll now just need to type in the email address of the guest user in the pop-up window, click on the Invite button, and they'll be sent an email inviting them to view the case. Guest users will be added to the users list after they've been added, and you can use the drop-down menu next to the username to change their permission level. The system will create a new user account for the person you invited, with the type set to Guest. If you're a member of the Tenant Administrator group, you can go into the users list and make any changes to the user's information fields, such as adding their real name or phone number.